Apparently, you can bypass JWT authentication simply by adding a header to the request. So while I was scrolling on Twitter, I came across a tweet about a new vulnerability. This is the exploit and you can just simply add a header to the request and the server won't check the JWT token. So let's dig a little deep into it. They also provided this GitHub blog and this vulnerability was found in ESP version 2. You must be thinking, what is ESP? So this is a service infrastructure that allows you to protect your APIs by using Google Cloud endpoints. So it is fully managed, scalable, and highly available infrastructure that makes it easy to secure your API and monitor its usage. What's happening here? So the ESP version 2 contains the authentication bypass vulnerability that allows API clients to bypass JWT authentication in specific cases. Let's first understand what this header is, XHTTP method override. So XHTTP method override is used in situations where only GET and POST HTTP methods are available. This can happen when the service or its consumers are behind a firewall or if the main consumer is a web page. In such cases, the missing verbs can be emulated by passing the XHTTP method override header in the request. For example, an API client can send a PUT request over a POST by adding this header to the request. So basically, if the HTTP methods are not available with the help of this header, you can use different HTTP methods. Let's understand with an example. Suppose a simple REST API service accepts POST request at the path slash restricted. The service is put behind ESP version 2 and ESP is configured to accept POST requests only from the client that provide a valid JWT token. If a malicious API client makes a PUT request and passes the POST method in the X HTTP method override header, the malicious client successfully bypasses without specifying a JWT. So it works only if the two conditions are true. The requested HTTP method is not in the API service definition. For example, put. Put was not in the API service definition and the specified post method in the X HTTP method override header is allowed in the API service definition. So since it is allowed, ESP forwards the request to the backend without checking the JWT, allowing attackers to craft request with a malicious header. Well, this is pretty interesting, right? So they have mitigated this vulnerability. You can upgrade deployments to 2.43.0 version or higher. This release ensures that the JWT authentication occurs even when the caller is specified X HTTP method override header in the request. Okay, so that's the quick update for you. Also, if you have any video suggestions related to API hacking, you can comment down below and I'll check it out. So thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.